friends, this is MD Vegan, my order. <laughs> Today I'm going to make a tiger nut milk, also called chufa milk, that is from tiger nuts or chufas, and that are from the Arabs, they have imported it thousands of years ago, yeah, from uh, North Africa to Spain. Yeah, they, they made the whole thing there, they decided about the architecture of South Europe, Spain, Southwest Europe, and um, we can see it nowadays even, wonderful buildings all over Spain, influenced by this beautiful Arab architecture, ornaments, uh, not so many pictures from people or animals, it was not allowed in the Muslim world to, um, to depict persons. So they, they decided to, put to, to use ornaments instead, ornaments that could be talking to you and you begin to imagine things. Uh, fascinating art has, has come from that to us, but now it is about this true family and fascinating too. It is the tiger nuts, they are not, not really nuts, they are like tubers. Yeah, they come from, from um, a kind of grass and in the, in the, under the earth they are growing these um, tubers like potatoes, like rhizomes. They are growing in all directions, without a center. Fascinating. And I have made this the milk of the chufas. I've shown you another in another video. It is a wonderful um, milk in Spain. The people have it every day. They eat the chufas like that, and um, enjoy in the evening. You go walking on the, on the, over this, uh, at, at night with many people from the from the village. They all meet all together at night when it's dark and still warm in Spain. It's warm there, and they have the chufa drinks. Like um, we have um, other sweet drinks also sodas. They have the chufa milk, and it's so healthy. We don't need regular, uh, regular cow milk or uh, animal milk. We have these um, a huge variety of plant milk, and this chufa milk, the tiger nut milk, has been known for uh, maybe four thousand years or so, and it never been uh, recorded any allergy, allergic reaction. So it's completely safe and super healthy. And the fiber in the chufa milk, and the chufa itself. It uh, is the best uh, nutrient for the bacteria in the, in the intestine. And it's wonderful. Today I make a sweet version of this. Uh, for, as a, for example, as a dessert for a fasting day, just fasting day. In the evening I always like to have a sweet milk, uh, plant milk, plant milk here. And I use as a, as a spices some dates to make it nice and sweet, some cinnamon, and a little bit of um, vanilla. By the way, this is... Um, Maybe you won't believe this is raw vanilla. It, there is raw vanilla indeed. You can buy it. It's not easy to get it, but it is there. And it tastes different from the, from the cooked vanilla. You usually get that. And uh, I won't tell you where it gets you, where you get it. You will find it if you look for it. If you're interested, it's not so important. It's a small thing only. But I only take this if I can. Now, so I just put a little bit of my vanilla, my, my uh, chufa milk. Oh, it tastes so nice even without anything. But for dessert, you can refine it. Yeah, I'll take a little bit into my blender. And um, for this, maybe I use just three dates or four. And um, maybe uh, half a teaspoon of cinnamon. I'll put it all in. Doesn't matter. I take one teaspoon of vanilla, half teaspoon, no, one teaspoon of cinnamon, half teaspoon of vanilla, and five dates. So what? They're really sweet and spicy for me. I like today. It's up to you how much you take, by the way. I always take a little bit more cinnamon than vanilla. Cinnamon is also very healthy. It has lots of anti like antioxidants. Uh, it's maybe more than anything else, almost. Cinnamon is really great if you have the right blend. It has to be from Ceylon, from Sri Lanka, not the other one. So, yeah, another subject now. But here I go. <laughs>
I'm curious how this will do now. My variation for today. Let's taste it. Mmm. Ah. So delicious. Wonderful. Ah, the cinnamon here in this Sufa milk, together with the dates and the vanilla, it gets something like a citrus um, flavor. Wow, you have to try that. It's really the essence of the cinnamon. Can, cinnamon comes out here in that drink. It's a wonderful combination. I'm really happy to try it here. And here I show you a, a little glass full so that you can see how it looks, what it looks like if it runs down into the glass. Like, mmm, it's color, it's fluidity, it's delicious. Look. <laughs> Do you think? Isn't it wonderful? It really tastes amazing. There are so many ways I can make recipes with this, and I recommend you to use the chufa milk. I made another video on the chufa milk itself, but it is very easy. You have to soak the chufas and then blend it and I'll filter it. Enjoy! Subscribe to my channel and be vegan on YouTube. I see you soon.